All right, guys, we take a look at a forecast out there today, which is really going to be a little bit on the milder side of things, which I think you're probably going to enjoy. But the days are still very, very, very short. This one's a little bit longer than yesterday, but we're still at just 716 for the sunrise time and 423 for the sunset time, which puts us at a day length of only nine hours and seven minutes. We're at nine hours and seven minutes again tomorrow. Then finally on Christmas Eve, we go up to nine hours and eight minutes. And from there, it's all uphill. We take a look at a forecast up there that looks pretty good. I've got Waukegan at 35 degrees, 35 O'Hare, 37 Midway, 30 degrees for Aurora. We may go down a little bit temperature wise and then just kind of stabilize for the rest of the day. Wind chills coming in in the 20s and low 30s. Forecast highs around the country are looking better. Still in the 30s for the coldest temperatures. And that's pretty good considering where we were just a week ago. Radar picture right now showing dry conditions, but we are looking at the potential for there to be some snow that could stick on Friday night. This is at about 5.30 Friday evening. It's nothing really to write home about, but looking at some rain across areas south of I-80, north of I-80, a little bit more in the way of potential snow. And then it's all rain and exits the area on off to the east uh, by or very, very early Saturday morning. We're looking at maybe less than an inch of accumulation in the blue shaded area, maybe one to two up around Rockford. Now, that's pretty much all we are, though, looking at the chance of rain on Christmas. Clouds clearing and warming today up into the 30s. But uh, take a look at Christmas Eve. That's also the first day of Hanukkah at sundown. It looks like Saturday is going to be basically dry. And then after midnight, Saturday night into early Sunday, could see some freezing rain, which leads to just regular old rain to start the day on Christmas.